My name is Zach. Um, I'm a student researcher at the Bodega Marine Laboratory for the Summer Session 1 in 2023. My name is Douglas. Uh, I'm a student for the Summer Session 1 and I'm doing research on sea urchins and their feeding rates. So we know that the purple urchin is an important predator on giant kelp forests and that they have become more and more abundant in areas that they haven't been due to climate change. Um, we know how they affect giant kelp at current temperatures, but we don't know how they will react to increased temperatures. What we're planning to do is, is seeing if temperature affects uh, sea urchins feeding fever. So the way we'll answer this is by setting up three tanks, one 12 degrees Celsius, one 15 degrees Celsius, and one 18 degrees Celsius. And from there, we're gonna let the we're gonna put a box with a sea urchin, a piece of blade, and a stipe, and we're gonna let each sea urchin rest inside the tank of different degrees for about a day. And from at the end of the day, we'll see how much of the stipe or blade it ate by weighing it and see if feeding rate changed depending on the temperature or if preference changed depending on the temperature. So the. Our biggest results we hope to find is that we're going to see a higher feeding rate and a higher preference for the blade, but also a higher preference for the stipe too, in, in 18 degrees Celsius compared to the other, uh, the other lower degrees. As climate change progresses and purple urchins become more abundant in areas that they hadn't been before, um, more kelp forests could be decimated by the urchins and Kelp forests are, a, are an important ecosystem for a lot of organisms. So I, the most exciting part for me is being able to come up with your own idea, come up with your own experiment. It is like coming up with your own experiment and being able to design the whole process. It takes a lot of work, it's really time consuming, but like being really creative with your thought process and your ideas and how to accomplish your question or how to answer your question is the funnest part for me. It's like a, solving a puzzle. 